difficult to survive when you are young and you don't know what to do. You don't want to be completely alone out here. You don't. It's hard as hell. I was completely alone. The homeless population really actually needs kind of a, a, a hand up instead of a hand out. Late at night, I wake up from the cold. Another fight, yeah, we broke the mold. You were right, but I needed you to know. All I want is everything. My mom was a heroin dealer, so I ended up leaving at 12. For me, it was to escape, like, the reality of what my mom was doing, and I didn't want anything to do with it after that. Me and my mom, we didn't have the best relationship, so I packed up all my stuff, and I ended up leaving and staying outside. Yeah, I've been doing this for almost six years, but still there's that, like, chance that somebody pulled a gun on me or actually pulled a knife on me. You know, I'm gonna have to actually use my knife. That can happen out here. Sometimes I do miss being in a bed versus a leaf and dirt-filled floor. 12 years old, I started getting into like cocaine, and then after that, I got into methamphetamine, acid, heroin. And I didn't really realize how hard the streets were until I hit the streets. We're doing everything. All I want you. Is everything. I hit the streets so I can clear my head under the heat of me on But I meant every word I said All I want is everything All I want is everything Look at it. Yeah, it looks like dinner to me. I make some really good school chili. This motherfucker right here is coolest motherfucker I've met since I've been here. Waiting on a new ukulele in the mail. I'm digging and it. then I'm gonna save up for a pair of Heelys. I mean, we're not bad people. We don't steal, we clean up after ourselves, we self bleed really, really well. Good morning. Uh, you just banged it? Yeah, I don't really care if I get money or not. I just want to smile. <laughs> I'm digging it. We go through like violence, we go through people robbing people, stabbings, hunger. Older people take care of the younger people. Friends take care of friends. You have people who you're really attached to. And I'm over here like, why would you want to be with somebody who's on the street and barely ever gets to have a shower, a home cooked meal, friends who barely ever want to be his friend. And one of the biggest things when you're out on the streets is to learn how to not be so attached to where it's easy to move on like with like that. Nobody has your back. It's every man for himself. This love is keeping me alive. When push comes to shove, will we survive? What are we doing? Getting food. You know what we're doing. Is there enough when you look into my eyes? I know it gets hard out here, but as long as you're alive and you're okay, you can still make your life better. If you actually truly care about people and you truly actually put the effort into it, 
things do come out like a good way. Morning comes, thought I'd never see the sun. Dragonfly, you've always been.